Okay. <clears throat> In this video, we are going to look at transpose of a matrix. So I'm going to define what a transpose of a matrix is, and I'm also going to share with you the symbol of a transpose of a matrix, as well as I'm going to demonstrate on three matrices on how to find the transpose of matrix. Okay, if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, we invite you to subscribe to our YouTube channel and also invite your friends to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Now, let's get started. Okay, so a symbol for a transpose is the name of a, trans of a matrix is the power T. Okay, so a symbol for transpose is denoted by writing the name of a matrix or the letter that stands for the matrix then that letter lays the power t so you put a small t on top of that letter okay so what is a, a transpose so a transpose is a matrix where you interchange the laws and the column so that is a transpose of a matrix. So to write the transpose of a matrix, you interchange the laws and the columns. What was the laws becomes the columns, and what was the column becomes a law. Okay. What is a law in a matrix, in a given matrix, becomes a column in a transpose of that matrix. And what was the column in that matrix which is given becomes a law in a transpose of that matrix. Okay, let's now put the, the explanation into, um, into use. Okay, so let's write transposes of matrices below. So the first matrix is A is equal to 6, 4, 3, 9, 2, or oh, 2, 9, 1. Okay, that is the matrix 6, 4, 3, 2, 9, 1. Okay, so now we are asked to write the transpose of this matrix. So what happens is, we are, what was, what is the law? The first law in the given matrix becomes the first column in the in the transpose. So, the, what is the the first law in the in the given matrix? So the first law is this one, which is six, four, three. So 6, 4, 3 is the first row in this matrix will become the first column in the second, in, in the transpose of this matrix. So what I mean is, I'm going to write like this. 6 is the beginning um, element in the given um, matrix in the first row. It will become the, the beginning um, matrix in the transpose in the first column and then four will follow and three comes at the end so it's just the, that i've taken the all law and make it a column what was in the beginning when you start counting from the left going to the right what was in the beginning comes on top then what is on the middle be on the middle or below the top then the last element becomes the one which goes on the bottom of the elements in the transpose okay then the same thing happens to the second the second law the second law will become the second caller where i'm going to write two nine one so it's going to be like this two nine one then i'm going to close the bracket now this one is the transpose of matrix a so this is the correct transpose of matrix c Okay, <clears throat> so it's not really difficult. What is there is just you just interchange the laws and the column. That's all. Then what you get after you interchange the laws and the column becomes the transpose of that matrix. Okay, now let's go to question number two. Okay, so in question number two, we have got a matrix which is uh, B is equal to three, negative two. So we want to write the transpose of B, of matrix B. We want to write the transpose of matrix B, which is going to be like that. Then this 
um, law this is in a law matrix so a law matrix when you're given a law matrix the transpose of a law matrix is in a column matrix a matrix with one column since the, the, the given matrix is has one law that means the transpose will have one column so we're going to write three two three negative two down three negative two then we close so this is the transpose of matrix b so matrix b transpose is three on top negative two down so the the matrix which was given the question was a low matrix the transpose has become the column matrix okay let's go to the last question which is c okay and this is a square matrix okay so now we want to find the the transpose of c okay matrix c the transpose of matrix c so we're going to write c then transpose sign then equal to okay so we're going to open bracket now as you can see um, this is a square matrix so it's a two by two that means even the transpose will be two by two but you note that only two figures will swap places only two nine and eight are the ones that are going to swap places only okay so now let's write the the element of this c transpose so this is what we're going to start with we're going to start with the first law which will change it into the first column so 6 8 we are going to have 6 on top and 8 down then once we are done with that with the first law we come to the second law which is 9 7 so we're going to have 9 on top 7 down so like that then we close bracket and then that will be the answer now when you look at this uh, square matrix as you can see 6 is there on the face when you look at the position of 6 in the in the both matrix they occupy the same position as well as 7 is occupying the same position in the first matrix and the transpose and then only 8 and 9 have swapped places so 9 which was, was on top has come down and 9 which was down has gone on top and the one the 8 which was on top has come down so basically this is how you write the transposes of matrices so if you have questions you can write them in the comment section i would love to work on them and if you have a question that you okay, came which was on transpose and it's confusing me you can still comment it in the uh, comment section i'll be great to work on it thank you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed to our youtube channel we invite you to subscribe to our youtube channel and if you found this video help remember to like it and share with your friends thank you so much for watching god bless you